Lightning test one, no motor aid, ignition on. All right, priming the cylinder. Do like one second, like. Oh my God. Ready? All right, ignition's on, give it a crank. Set a slight charge. Okay. Ignition Watch on. Watch your face. What? Watch your face. <laughs> backyard shed right now mainly because I do not want to take this indoors because of the fumes that we've uh, put into this thing and just an overview this is the Lego two-stroke we tried to minimize the use of uh, non Lego parts or crazy glue uh, but you can see that the cylinder head here uh, this top is made out of hard plastic got I got it from a, a Tupperware container or lid and we know that bricks don't really make a good seal so that's why we taped it over here and back there you see the check valve. The purpose of the check valve is to draw in air so that we have that air needed for combustion. And as you can see in the video, we actually gave up with the transfer port. Our idea was that the transfer port was too big. The volume of the, the fuel and air mixture isn't getting from the crankcase to the top of the cylinder. And I guess it has to do with the weather and the temperature because I have my two stroke weed whacker over here and it does not like the cold so if we can't expect this to to, to run uh, with with one turn of the flywheel we can't expect something like a, a Lego two-stroke to, to work either uh, this is the flywheel we wanted to use weights that are equally heavy so we just used two AA batteries just because it was easy to find we hope that that would give us the momentum to keep the, the motor going but unfortunately it didn't these are the bottles that we used as the fuel and I can tell you that none of it worked. So we gave up with the whole check valve idea and started to inject uh, air duster air straight into the transfer port like this. Uh, at the same time, we also tried injecting butane. Uh, as you can see that it comes down here. So you would put in the air this way and you would add in the butane from the top. So by the time they reach this point, they would be evenly mixed and would enter the combustion chamber uh, so that's what we were planning to do and even with that it still did not want to fire so it really has to do with the temperature and the weather here in New York is not really doing too well and plus we have a lot of rainy days so I really wanted to put this video out as soon as possible but the weather is not uh, gonna allow me to do that as far as the ignition system as far as the ignition system goes, we just use the mosquito zapper and um, a breaker point arm that opens and closes, making the contacts here. Um, I mean, our previous tests proved that it was a, a sufficient enough spark to ignite 
the, the axe and, and air mixture talking about axe body spray but I guess today is not the day when we did put oil in the combustion chamber we were actually when we put oil in the combustion chamber or around the cylinder we were actually getting pretty good compression I mean it was to the point where you can actually feel it when you turned it with your finger so we know we have plenty of that and, and I guess this is the only part where we use crazy glue and hot glue and uh, a non lego piece for the head mainly because this is the most vulnerable part we want this part to house the combustion process other than that we put tape around it as well in the crankcase and up on the combustion chamber or the cylinder I guess the main problem is that it's really hard to get the mixture correct especially when you don't have a means of uh, metering the fuel and the air you're kind of just injecting whatever you have all out into the into the combustion chamber um, and yeah that's about it uh, we're basically giving giving up for today but that does not mean that we're gonna be giving up uh, in the future um, we know that butane butane doesn't work because while we were doing it it was actually there was a huge pool of butane in the tube uh, so it's either that we're not getting enough air or we actually we were getting enough air because I was using the air duster and I wasn't sticking it in all the way I was just putting it I was just putting it in so where the velocity of the air can draw in more outside air to go into the tube but unfortunately that wasn't enough so there's a problem that we're missing here I mean uh, our, our designer concept is correct we did take into account everything uh, that a two-stroke will do and and put it into here including the, the flywheel and, and ignition system and and delayed ignition timing to prevent kickback uh, but I don't think it's gonna be rotating itself soon